previously on the adventures of Mr. Red Truck. Why am I doing this job? Ow. Where's my friend at? Hey. What is it? Shouldn't we have the... Should, do we have... I'm sure we have finished... I'm sure you have finished that list of ways to scare Mr. Red Truck, huh? Here's the important question. Has he turned back into a regular car? He has. And you didn't know. Anyways, is, I'm pretty sure I have finished that list. Come with me. Okay. After they have read the list. We'll try number one. <laughs> A train is coming. Oh, I know what to do. I guess step one failed. I have to find a way to 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 scare Mr. Red Shop, or else he he we won't be the ones to scare him. Let me whisper into your ear. Here's step two. You know that won't work, Mr. Blue Car. I mean, Bluey. Why won't that work? All cars are scared of that. Well, Mr. Red Truck is different. Haven't you heard from the previous episode? Oh, yeah. So we're just acting. Please do not reveal the secrets of this show. Okay. But still, Mr. Red Truck can handle that. Whatever. Mr. Red Truck can handle that. Nothing. Why, well, I can scare him. Good luck having the worst. I'll be fine. Step three, two, I mean. I just have to sneak up to the top of the roof and jump on it. Make sure I don't wake him up. Oh my god! It's my day! What the f- I knew I should have listened to that. I knew I should have listened to the... I knew I should have listened to Mr. Blue's sports car. <coughs> Mr. Red Truck has his mind. Mr. Red Truck, I know he has his, that mind. I should take his mind. Uh, I should take his in mind off of him and replace it with a new one so I can definitely scare him. This. That. I'm out of here. I knew I should have listened to that, to that car. Step two failed. I cussed a lot because of Mr. Red Chuck. He, 
I should have listened to you. You did what? You cast a lot. Hey, what's going on here? We're trying to find some steps to... He made a list of ways to scare Mr. Red Truck. Ow! You hurt me. Oh, I did not. Now you did. I did not. Now you did. I did not. So, we have to... Uh, okay, let's try step three. Can you tell me what step three is? Okay. Scary by airplane. That will not work either. I'll try. A lock. Step three. Step Step three failed. Then what do we do now? I'll do step four. What is step four? Do the explosions in the distance. Still, that won't work. Trust me, it will work on Mr. Red Chop to scare him. I suggest... Uh, I do not suggest that idea. That will be... Useless. Step four. Scary Mr. Red Truck with distant explosions. Hold on a second. <laughs> we have to make sure the distant explosions. We have to make sure it's a fully cloudy day to do that. Step four. <sighs> There we go. Now let's. Now we have the chance to get Mr. Red Truck scared. Hold on a minute. Let's try with Ray. That will be the perfect idea to scare Mr. Red Truck. This an explosion with rain. We have to make sure. Uh, well, we can't do this in Carland. Oh right. We'll try the uh we'll try the previous way. On step four. Okay. Only one in car land. Trust me, it will work on Mr. Red Truck's anxiety. Mr. Red Truck does not have anxiety. Trust me. Step four again. Three, two, one, action! <laughs> Replay. I guess that didn't work. I saw the cameras of Mr. Red Chuck. He got a bit too excited. Back at the... Back at the contest area. It did not work. He got a bit too excited. I told you. Let's try step five. What is step five? There was a scary voice out of nowhere. Okay, you do the action. I listen. Okay, I hope this works on Mr. Red Truck's anxiety. I told you it won't work. You accepted me. Ow! I found the perfect helicopter. Oh, this has a pilot inside. I'll choose the other helicopter. Mm. Do the 
a voice action. Make sure it's a super loud voice, and make sure no one ca make sure no one catches you, or else you'll get caught and in trouble. Okay, I'll do it with my super loud megaphone. Hello. Ryan. I am about to destroy the world of Carland. If you do not go in your basements, I will step on your cars. Oh, I do not believe that. That is nothing. The giant wouldn't even enter Carland. I don't. I don't care about giants in car land. What the? I had enough. The step these steps are useless to Mr. Red Truck. S scary. I cannot even find ways to scare Mr. Red Truck. Let's go on to step six. What is step six? Step six, you make millions and millions of rumbles with your voice on my megaphone. Make sure Mr. Red Truck is about, um, not, um, not past the limit of how, of the, of how much area you can hear the megaphone with. Okay, I'll give it a try. If this doesn't work, then I'm going to have to tell Mr. Blue Car, and he'll be so angry. If I can just get a good grip on the seat and make sure he doesn't catch me. Three, two, one... Action! Okay, that didn't work. That didn't work. I'm gonna have to tell Blue Mr. Bluey and then I'll get so bad. I'm quite scared to tell him. Mr. Blue Car? I mean, Mr. Bluey. What? And also, why do you keep mistaking my name? Well, I just keep forgetting your name. Well, what do you want? It didn't work. <laughs> it didn't work? How can we scare Mr. Red Chuck? Let's go on to step six. Step six is point a flickering light at him. I am I'm telling you, that won't work. You're just making things up. No, I actually have that in my list. Okay, have a fun time. Losing a, a scary Mr. Red Truck. I will win, no matter what. Okay. <laughs> All I have to do is turn on the light on the helicopter and it will and it will turn on the whole world of Carland. It will be